Like you must not go like me. <laughs> well, you now know. you do with your mouth. Yeah. Okay, go Thank you for the hour for dentist. <laughs> yeah, yeah, now you know. it's just like cuts everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. In fact, welcome to my first ever Q&A and today I'm here with my best friend hey. <laughs> and um, I have Kune here. Hey guys, I'm Kune, like you said. <laughs> and I have Tracy and uh, they're here to help me with the Q&A. Mm -hmm. Ladies, are you guys ready? I'm nervous but yeah. <laughs> Wait, I think we're ready. Yeah. Okay, so this is how it's gonna be. Um, I got all your questions. Thank you very much for sending them through and uh, We put them all in this little bowl here and what's gonna happen. We will each pick one Open it up to ask the question and uh, we'll just keep talking So if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe like comment and then keep connected So don't forget to share with your friends. Too. Yeah Okay, show them I have down. So, who's gonna start first? <laughs> Rumble it up! <laughs> Since Rumble. I help cut the pieces, mm. someone else is gonna start. Madame. Wow, okay, cool. <laughs> Rum roll, please! Let's see if I'll forget to read. <laughs> okay, so the question is mm -hmm. okay, 20% training and 80% food. Mm -hmm. What does that even mean? And what's your take on it? So is it 20? Yeah. I think that's in okay. No, 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 no. I'm, I was just making a comment on the whole thing. I think that's a hell of a lifeline that they like to use that 20% training mm -hmm. and then the rest is just basically food and nutrition and whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah, which I also still don't understand because hey, most of the time I'm in the gym. Most of the time, and most of the other time, I'm also eating, so it's like 50 50 for me. Most yeah. of the time, I'm also eating. Yeah, most of the time, so it's like 50 50. No, but, the, um, but then there is this thing, okay, like 80% um, of your body is uh, genetics and uh, what you eat. Yeah, so then the 20% really is just the work you put it in the gym. Yeah, so sometimes you see people like they work not in the gym like six months, eight months, but then this person is just not growing. You know, or maybe like this person is working out so much, like for example, the eighty percent, and then the twenty percent is like they're not eating. Mm -hmm. No offense, but that's why you got skinny people with mm, biceps and all these crazy <laughs> things. Skinny people with biceps. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only thing I could think of. Harsh, but it's fair. harsh, but it's true. <laughs> okay, we're moving on. Okay, we're moving on, Madame. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I grab two, I grab two, I grab two. So, okay, so, okay, so. One, one. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. So, here's the next question, y'all. So <laughs> Are there exercises to also enlarge? <coughs> I think I need to drink this. I'm, oh, yeah. I'm scared. Sorry. The penis. <laughs> if so, uh, which ones? And if not, why so? So, I don't know. Somebody is asking about penis enlargement because y'all be talking about exercising, growing the muscles, you know, muscles. Also, the penis is having some muscles in it, so I guess. Um, I can't. I can't. <clears throat> it just makes sense to ask whether but, you can grow your penis. <laughs> but wait, wait. wait. Is, 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 is penis enlargement a thing though? I've heard about surgeries. Huh? I, 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 yeah, I've heard about people that went for surgical procedures for. To wait, the length or the width? Oh, good question. Yeah, good, good question. I've only heard it? about the the ointments. What, what do they do? <laughs> or like just rub it on or it's something. Free. It's like it's like you when you're trying so to get much. a booty and then like oh yeah it's like a booty ointment that you can use. So it's like but they even, okay what are the booty ointments? Do they work? I don't even know, but then some of them work. Like I've seen like documentaries, like some like in uh, Angola. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the booty changes or like the boobs change as well. So. Does it get perkier? Can you ever get it? Lift it? So I think it's like the perkiness. Where can that comes from? I think it's the width, not like. No, are we talking about the boob or the penis? Yeah, now, now I switched up the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I know, I know that they. Oopsie. I know. <laughs> wait, give me a minute. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, 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 a minute. 
mm-hmm. I know mm-hmm. that there are some people, mm-hmm. or not some people, but I've watched a documentary, mm-hmm. whatever, where a uh, guys they use vacuum, so they put their dingy lingy <laughs> in this vacuum thing, and then they pull it and push it and pull it, and they're kind of like elongated. But my question is like. So making it longer doesn't it become thin though? Yeah, because I feel like it's just focusing on the length now. Yeah. It's gonna be like. But if. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not gonna say it's gonna become thin. I need to stop really? talking. My mom might see this. So, <laughs> so in other words, so this question exercises so or <laughs> elongation and uh, the weight, how, how do you call that? The thickness. The thickness, there's nothing like that. Exercising, maybe you go to the gym and it's like just a whole machine that is. But wait, yeah, I, I, I have a feeling. I have a feeling. Like, mm-hmm. there's, a, there's a whole video on it on YouTube. <laughs> I have, like somebody literally, you know, working out their penis, mm-hmm. yeah. like sit ups and push ups, yeah. whatever. And yeah. I don't know. Uh, maybe there could be. I mean, the fact that you can work in your chest, and like, there's a way of like working around your boobies, you know, like making them. But what here. muscles are so, in the penis? I don't know, maybe Wait, there is. Are there muscles in the penis? Yeah, there's yeah. Everywhere. Something cavernosus. Huh. Mm. Okay, guys. Well, don't know anyway. what that is, but okay. <laughs> Gosh, anyway, moving on. It's my yeah, turn. it's your turn, baby. Oh, God, please. <laughs> Some of these questions. I just, my dear. I don't know if I should bring to it or, or let me just. Okay. Talk. Let's see what it says here. Mm-hmm. So like cute oh! Mm-hmm. oh my goodness. So this one says a threesome or masturbation. <sighs> Loud Jesus. So, what would you choose? Would you rather have a threesome or would you masturbate? Mm. <laughs> what is a threesome, Basil? Three people in bed, honey, doing the things to be done. <laughs> Three girls, three boys. It doesn't. Depending. It doesn't. Whatever you want. Ooh, wait, yeah. It doesn't matter, hey. Yeah. It can be two guys, one girl. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> two guys, or one just girl. Three women. Or three women. Get me on. Yeah. Three men. Get it. Oof. No. Anyway, anywho, three some or masturbation. What would you choose? Nancy. Uh, did I say Nancy? Wow. I know. I'm concerned <laughs> about. <like, laughs> I'm not concerned about like, um, diseases, infections, and I'm just like, Ugh, I don't want another person in my bed. Plus, I think I'm very, I'm like, I'm all about me and my man. So yeah. I wouldn't want to, you know, share my attention with somebody else. So all that for me, honey. So no more. Yeah. So no threesome. I'd rather masturbate, although like I, I feel uncomfortable doing it. So I'd rather take that. So yeah. I mean. <laughs> No, personally, if I wasn't in a relationship, well, I wouldn't mind the threesome, you know? Because, but if, since now I'm like in a relationship, I'm sorry guys. <laughs> threesome, no, I'm too selfish. What's mine is mine, I wouldn't want to shake. Yeah. But if I was not in a relationship, I'm going to do it for fun because, hey. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. yeah. I'm just saying, like, I'm freaky. Mm. And Lord Jesus knew what he was doing. Mm. If my man is up for a threesome, if he exists. Mm-hmm. So you're gonna be watching him stick it in someone's uh... No! Mm-hmm. I will beat her. She oh, can't she only getting 20%. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm like, whoa, well, don't, don't do that. Also, yeah, give me chance. <laughs> but it just no men have this uh, freakiness in their brain. It's another word. That they just they like an extra something, something, you know. Mm-hmm. And if my man ever says we're gonna be let's find the my let's get in the third person. One, I will get somebody, check them out. Like I will, like I will get them tested. I need to know where we stand with you. Yeah. And then obviously just somebody that I would never see again, because I wouldn't want to see you the next day. And, and, you know, have their face like I know your insides. But you think they're like, yeah. Will it turn you on the whole another girl, my guy? The, as like, long as she's not prettier than me. So you don't think that you'll be just letting you. You know, I don't know, all kind of weird thoughts going on. You're not even enjoying the moment, you're just like, I'm just doing this stuff as well. Girl, just because. Let's get alcohol, let's just. Enjoy <laughs> it. Yeah, but for the masturbation part, well, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm for that. Cheers. Ooh, yeah. Cheers to the sex toys, to the wow wow, to the fingers, you know, Ooh, to the candlelight. But there are some crazy sex toys. 
Uh, nice. <coughs> the one with the three things, two things, the one thing. <laughs> the two things. Yeah. The things. The things to be done. Yes. <laughs> so, for me, it's both ways. Yeah. Honestly, it's the whoopsie. We're getting freaky. For me, it's both, <laughs> both ways. I don't mind. Um, I just need somebody who is as freaky as I am. Yeah. Because you don't mind you attacking. That the door we don't see. Post that get that. We feel like what? What is that? <laughs> oh, oh, oh man. Nah. Nah. So yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. <laughs> so we're moving on. Let me shake it up. Let me shake yeah. it up. I'm gonna take you that for Nancy. <coughs> Nancy, you are crazy. I don't know why your name is so close to Nancy, but it's crazy. I'm it's so sorry. far. <laughs> At least Stacy. Okay, fine. <laughs> Stacy, Tracy, Nancy. Okay. Okay, so what we got? I guess it is. Ooh! Oh, I almost went oh, up. Round. Round. Oh, loud. I don't think I was supposed round. to. Round. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, cool. So apparently, when are you getting married? Who? Wow. Hmm. When are you getting married? I need a drink. When are you getting married? And what kind of question is that even? Those <laughs> okay, are the people that want to come to your wedding and eat all your food. Right. And even be like, ooh, her dress was ugly. Yeah. Um, I would like to have that oh, RSVP. You know, like if you don't show up, then it's cool. I'm going to charge ooh, you. Yeah. And have yeah. a destination wedding. That yeah. way, Nobody, not a lot of people can come. Great. Yeah. So you said invitations? Yeah. But they're like, no, we couldn't come because we didn't have money to go. Yes. Yeah. It's what I want it! The question uh, remains unanswered. Yeah, we still have an answer. Oh, okay. When <laughs> are you getting married? I don't know. I mean, my relationship is like. I just answer the question. Yeah, so. answer the question first. Yo, uh, when am I getting married? When I start thinking about marriage, probably. I'm not even thinking about marriage right now, so. Yo, I have no idea. Yeah. Yeah. Probably somewhere along the line. When are you getting married? When am I getting married? Mm. Okay. I don't know. My relationship is like what? Three? No. Six years. Mm. <gasps> oh my god! Three four months. So like it's still yeah, we're still in the honeymoon phase. Yeah, we're still okay. like yeah, but you know like during honeymoon phase you're like oh my gosh, let's just get married tomorrow. Really? Yeah. But then like yeah, you're always like excited. Like I read an article today like two students from SA, mm -hmm. like they've known each other for like two weeks and like they already got married. <gasps> yeah. But that's so soon though. Oh, Way too soon. Like people do the most drastic stuff. Yeah. You know, so it's um, like um, um, when you go marry them after two weeks and then like, things come on to you. Mm -hmm. um, so like you don't really know. I'm just saying like right now like I'm enjoying what I'm having with my partner. Mm -hmm. You know like yes babe, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> and we're getting to <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 yeah. So like okay, I'm just the babe. Cheers to the babe. Yeah, the babe. The babe. Just enjoy the moment and then that ding, conversation ding, ding. will like come. Uh -huh. You know? Oh, that is so cute. Yeah. So what about you, Mimi? Oof, when am I getting in? Bye. <laughs> <laughs> He needs to find me first though, because I feel like he's lost in the bush. Yeah. Playing with some alligators, <laughs> looking at elephants and stuff. Nah, nah, nah. nah, nah, nah. Up here. He's busy getting his heart broken. Exactly. <coughs> but other uh, woman, and then when he comes, he has issues. Uh, <laughs> ah, that's yeah. a sad one. Uh, yeah. So sad. But anyway, I'm just like, if I find somebody that you know is is, is really vibing with me and wanna do life with me, mm -hmm. I'm up for it. But as at the moment, it's. Yeah, I just keep playing with my vibrator. Oh, okay, cool. Cheers to the vibrators once again. You're shaking it. To me, yeah. You're shaking it. Yay. And then Mimi is picking. I don't know, I'm the one that is. Oh, okay. <coughs> Wait, they're taking home. Dude, it's a big one. It's a big one. Ooh. Oh, guys. <laughs> so, it's. Why do I always get this many questions? <laughs> so, it says. Have you ever catfished anyone? Uh -huh. And how do you handle gym crushes? Yes, I said it right. <laughs> crushes. Crushes. Yeah. Catfish. Catfish. Yeah. What is to catfish again? What is to catfish? Let's let's give a definition. Catfish is when uh yo, you pretend to be someone else on the other side, and then the person meets you and you're like a whole different person. Okay, usually it's with the looks and mm. yeah, everything else. So you like have a different okay, not really a different, but probably 
face to what 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 so yeah. you kind of have a whole different um physical appearance sometimes even your whole personal it's different yeah, yeah. and the person meets you and you're like a whole different person yeah. you know in your in your in your in your deep you're like so slim and sexy and then you know, big booty yeah in reality you, you, you know. sure flat flat <laughs> flat man yeah flat. have i ever kept fished someone i don't know no oh, i don't you. know yeah i was yeah. You were? You were getting Nigga had me tripping over him. Yeah. Like, I was like, oh my gosh, he's so harsh. Like, he clean. <laughs> he cute. Like, thank you, Lord Jesus, mm -hmm. you know? And then I met him. He's like, no, come meet me at KFC. Mm -hmm. This was like in a mall or whatever. Yeah, and I'm so like, what was this? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I did. <laughs> Man, I don't know which people still go meet at KFC, but I don't know. No, back well, in high school, it was a thing. Back in high school, it was a thing. But though. it was a thing of like, I'm, 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 I'm in this shopping mall oh, okay. and I'm at KFC. Okay. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, okay, cool. So I walk and I'm looking for this person. I probably took out your phone to like. You and know. I took out my phone, I'm like, hey, I'm here with. Mm -hmm. Did you even say anything? Or you were just like, oh, is that is that you? I was, I was so surprised. What did you do? Like different looks. So, like I think they stole somebody else's profile. <laughs> yeah, that's possible. Yeah, it's a thing. Yeah, it's a thing. It's a thing. No, it was scary. Was, one. He came up to me like, hey, Mimi, how I'm like, I'm cool. And it's like, well, it's so nice to see you. I'm like, yeah, but I have to go. I have an appointment. You right said now. that. Yeah, oh, I have okay, an appointment cool. right now, and I'm so sorry I can't be here. Yeah. But we can meet tomorrow, though. Yeah. You know, just to eat at home. Tomorrow. Yeah, no, because my point is, like, I'm gonna go home, block, block his ass. Yeah. He yeah. ain't ever gonna see me no more. Yeah, people should really be honest. They should. Like, like yeah, but... Oh, and uh, how do you deal with uh, gym crushes? That word wow. is hard to say. I feel like I'm gonna say gym flashes. Am I crushing? Oh, I'm crushing. Am I crushing on them or are they crushing on me? Okay, let's okay. let's take that one. We can have both scenarios. Yeah. They're crushing on you. It depends though. Mm. Sometimes it's just some random person that yo man. Not even, I'm not gonna say, well, you're not attracted to the person, like, he doesn't interest you. I'm gonna ignore their ass, even nice. So probably like when he says hi and wants to, well, you know, come over the conversation, I just. Yeah. You know? Mm -hmm. But then if it's someone that I'm interested in, I'm gonna like. <laughs> you know, like, cool, you hey, you, oh, why? <laughs> Your crush is coming, hey, bro. I'm even start adding on plays like yeah. you know add on another play just to mm -hmm. give yeah. up in it. So so yeah. Gosh, like there's like really mm -hmm. some thirsty people at the gym, guys. Yeah, but Raya, for real. Yeah. Thirsty. Mm. Girl, tell thirsty. Me about, tell me about it. Tell me about the it. The ones that stare. Yeah. And and which other ones? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe <laughs> this is one that I don't know. Like you can view. You can actually see that this person is trying to like get your attention, like you're moving this way, you're moving, you're gonna pick up this, or you're doing legs. You could, the person was doing arms, but then like, I don't know, it's like they're following you or something. Yes. You go to the studio, it's like, okay, let me go to the studio as well, I don't know. Some, sometimes people can go to the extent of like going to the receptionist and be like, who is that girl? What is her name? I want what? to talk to yeah. her. That has happened to me. Well, yes, yes. And yes. They Why didn't you else? tell us? I'm ready to beat someone. Uh, it has happened. So, yeah, people go to such an extent, you know? I don't know. You know what I got though? Mm -hmm. So, and I still get it. Um, it's like, they get my number mm -hmm. at the gym. Where? Where? I don't know. Oh, oh, friends, just, someone. Yeah. It's like they see you talking to a guy, yeah, and then okay. they probably friends with that guy. Yeah. And yeah. they go, oh shit, kid, though, give me a number. Mm -hmm. And then I go home. It's twelve midnight, and then yeah, the phone rings, you. and then I'm like, hello, and then he, he's like, hi, oh, it's. Mm -hmm. And in my head, I'm thinking, like, oh my gosh, it's an emergency. Oh, my yeah. cousin, and then he's like, what are you doing? What the heck? I'm like, do that to me. <laughs> At 12. <laughs> you will call me and ask me what I'm doing. Yeah. 
That's just absurd. I don't know. And these are people that you shouldn't be entertaining. Like nothing good ever happens after midnight. Is it after midnight? After, after ten. After ten. After ten. After ten. Wait, no. why? Is it like after ten? You have enough time to talk to me during 10. the day. I think after ten, because after ten is a booty call. Yeah, I just feel like yeah. Okay, okay. let's say after ten is a slide. And after 12 is a booty call. Yeah. I feel like be respectful. If you're trying to get someone, at least do what you think is respectful, yeah. right? Like if you call me at 12 midnight, then all you want is the booty. For real. And I know by about to give up booty. Yeah. For real. And two My man. Man. Oh, anyway, face suck. face regime. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. so. Why are you looking at? Because you know the person next to you, obviously, the least in your glow. You know, you. your face is all glow. Ooh, yeah. so I'm glowing, but I'm not Mine too, but anyway, what do you use for your face, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. how do you keep it glowing and young, mm -hmm. young and full oh. dress? Okay, so I'm I'm like obsessed mm -hmm. with Jennifer Lopez. Like I feel like if I'm gonna be in my fifties, I should be like as youthful, as energetic, and as like just oof, you know J Lo. That woman is like oof, I love her. Like guys, yeah. So I once watched a video mm -hmm. how she keeps herself so young and you know energetic and whatever. So she drinks tons and tons of water, like two liters, I believe, and then she said like. On top of that, her number one secret is sunscreen. Okay. Now I know the sunscreen comes has a, like a lot of numbers, like SPF 50, 30, mm -hmm. uh, I think 25, and then 15. If you're gonna use an SPF for your face, mm -hmm. use 15, maybe 20. Yeah. yeah. Why? Why not just go up to 50? Because you know, it's supposed to protect you. Sorry. Yeah. And if you have noticed, no offense to white people, but y'all put on the sunscreen and then you guys go lie in the sun yeah. to get that bronzeness <laughs> so they always put on the spf 50 yeah mm -hmm. and then that is you say 15 or 50 50 oh so you say 50 yeah, yeah 50. Okay, cool, five, five. so if you put on spf 50 and you go in the sun it will burn you mm -hmm. like legit because the protection is high and so is the penetration right yeah, yeah. 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 trying to do everything your power to get rid of them because you once were used to this clear skin and now yeah, you have yeah. all these black spots <laughs> so what i did i got myself um an electrical face brush mm -hmm. it's the one it, it looks like a huge toothbrush yeah huge electrical toothbrush where you can put on the head and then you just take it and i think it's called evil something i, I can't remember so you just click the button and Wash it and that really really cleanses your face like it's a deep cleanser and um the soap that i use for oh, I, I, the thingy mm -hmm. brush you use every single day every is, single day like so, morning and evening so there was a, no such thing as uh, over i don't know over, over, over brushing, brushing? Yeah, yeah. no but you can must not go like <laughs> well, you know yeah. how you do with your mouth yeah. okay go the day some. before the hour before dentist <laughs> yeah no, you just get like cuts everywhere yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Girl, what <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no, you just do it gently, and I recommend to do that for like at least 40 seconds because the problem is like we wear a lot of makeup, right. and then we go home and we just wipe off and then wash it. Yeah. And then we think it's clean, but actually, the makeup penetrates. Penetrates, so guys, yeah, stop it. it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm just that. The um, mm -hmm. so yeah, you use the brush for yeah. 40 seconds, and then it really cleanses you. And the soap that I use, I'm currently using, um, it's like an aloe vera soap from Clicks. Yes, go 
Yeah, aloe vera is really good. It's like a little bar, it's 19 bucks. I don't know the name, it's like an IQ something. Like something. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah, I used that so and then after that I just I pet my face dry. In fact I don't pet my face dry, I take my toner and I put it on my face bed and um, I just wipe it off. I love with the toner. My mom always used to say that you put the toner on and then you wash it off. Yeah. Why? And then I grew up with that habit, like put the toner on, you're like, you're not supposed to give it in your face, you just wash it off. So you guys, like, what, what do you do? Why do you leave the toner on? You just wipe it. It's supposed to turn, and you leave it on. And then after that, then, if it's in the morning, mm -hmm. I apply sunscreen, SPF 15. But if it's. No, what if you have now a 50? Because I have a 50. Honey, throw it away. Why? What are you doing to yourself? Because you just feel like, oh, the sun. No, but but have you ever seen, like, when you apply it, you become all white? No. I, I saw you in the gym, girl. You was white. Hey, that, 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 that was a different sunscreen. I changed to another one. Don't worry. Oh, you <laughs> But when, when you saw her, did you say something to her? I didn't, didn't. On camera and I'm like talking to you and I have something right there like <laughs> I was, to I was like do you boo do you with a white face <laughs> <laughs> but you know I, <laughs> <laughs> all right cool fine so 15 I'm at only down to 15 go to 15 yeah I, I don't know but then why do they make why do they create the 50 like five zero. Hey. Like I said, it's for people that wanna get the bronzing, the toning. Mm -hmm. Like okay, fine. We have different shades. Like the lighter you are, the more protection you need. So yeah. that's why the SPF 50 is there. But the darker you are, the less protection you need, and that's why the SPF 50 is there. I'm mm -hmm. speaking under correction, but that's what I had mm -hmm. picked up. Mm -hmm. So if but if somebody can correct me, hey, we're all out here to learn. If yeah. you know about SPF, comment down below. Let us know. Yeah. All right. But, yeah, SPF. Uh, SPS. SPS. <laughs> you were laughing at Kune, now it's you. <laughs> SPS is the way forward, guys. What? I feel like I've You're not done, you're not done, you're not done. We're not done. You're not done. Not done. Okay. How do you moisturize your skin? What do you use? Oh, yeah. basically, general moisturization. Okay, okay. so, um, how I moisturize. Okay, how do I moisturize? Because you just ended with the toner and I just sent you with the. Bowl. Yeah, like I said, in the morning, um, I use sunscreen. Mm -hmm. That's all, and then. I haven't been applying makeup for a while because I want to get rid of my hyperpigmentation and I just feel like the makeup might get in the way of that. So mm -hmm. I'm only wearing makeup today because you know, it's for you guys. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry, I'm just kidding. And, and then, <laughs> and then um, when I'm at home, I actually have a L'Oreal. Mm -hmm. I wish I had bread on, but it's like a night cream. Mm -hmm. But I'm, oh my god, it's like a jelly. Okay. It's like L'Oreal night cream. Mm -hmm. It's like a jelly, but when you put it on, it's, it's like I feel like I have mint on my face. And I don't know about you guys, but if I'm using a product and it doesn't burn my face, I feel like it's not working. It's going to burn me. Yeah. It needs to a tingle. A tingle yeah. or something, you know? Yeah. So I use that and um, yeah, but um, so I use a lot of different products, but I want to go into that uh, divine intervention, or I don't know, divine whatever you call it, of using. One product like a brand, like if I'm gonna use L'Oreal, then I'm using the L'Oreal face wash, mm -hmm. the toner, and yeah. everything. Because what I've noticed is like if you use different products, they kind of like block mm -hmm. different mechanisms from that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's why I'm actually at like, the verge of finishing all my products. I use my scrub for my body, my face. So for my, I wanna finish it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so tired. So yeah, um, girl, what what do you use? Okay, so I. I have trouble, sorry, so much moist in my mouth. God bless you, whatever. I've always had like acne from such a young age, like ugh, like maybe seventh grade. Yeah. It's been horrible. I've tried everything, everything. No life boy, me. Girl. You remember life boy, the red one? Yes. I've tried everything. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, the problem usually comes when, you know these allergies that yeah. really get in the way? Like, imagine having acne and allergies. That is horrible. It's like your skin isn't peeling, it doesn't come right. So finally this year, I started using um, cell tone. Mm -hmm. I went to oh, clicks and I was like, okay, I've heard about you for so long. Like, yeah. Since I was in high school, this was the only product I think I've been trying. Mm -hmm. So I first started with a toner only. Mm -hmm. And believe me, you, it worked. 
within like two days it was like girl yes are you for real no no honestly it I'm worked that's a great fix so like <laughs> I, I started using cell tone and then this uh this lady from the pharmacy mm -hmm. is it Baroshana Mo mm -hmm. oh she's so nice she was like oh you're nice she was like I need something for my face and I was like I know it's like to get her so I started using the cell tone from Plex and then like the farmer there was SOS, just a little soap. I like that. Yeah? Yeah, it's really nice. It doesn't, it's, it's also good for like sensitive skin because mm -hmm. like I really have sensitive skin. So I started using like that soap, cell tone products yeah. and aloe vera. Oh, aloe vera is Aloe vera gel, like for my face. So it's, that's all I use now. Yeah. And like honestly, it's been working, like hyperpigmentation, my spots, because I usually get spot, like spots instead of like bumps. Mm -hmm. Now the bumps, I don't even get bumps anymore. And like, all the like blackheads, like they, I don't get blackheads yeah, anymore. Like honestly, like it works. I don't know, like I've been like on the last, you know. I was like, yeah, God, why? why? <laughs> I need to be pretty, okay? Yeah. Like, cause honestly, like acne gets in the way of your confidence. Cause it's like true. the yeah. whole time you're talking to someone, it's just feel like they're looking at you, like, and oh, what is that? that? You know, like, and you don't feel great. You yeah. know, like you don't feel great waking up in the morning. You don't feel great. I'm using makeup because like you know when you use makeup you want to feel like great you don't want to yeah. look cakey or something yeah. so you don't want to feel like you put on too much yeah okay. so yeah that's all I use oh, wow. yeah uh, personally I'm going ahead uh, facial I think uh, anything that I try just work but currently currently I am using Neutrogena some I think it's the one that comes in a blue container it's Hydro Boost or something 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 mm -hmm. like that it just feels the same, it looks the same, so... <laughs> you don't know the struggle. I don't know the struggle, but I, I'm using her regime, the whole... Uh, the castrabic thingy, yeah. but the only difference is the SP, whatever, whatever. SP. I, I used to use a 50, yeah, no, so 50 50. I'm gonna tone it down. Oh yeah, and, yeah. And then the only thing that she didn't mention that mm -hmm. I also do for my night... night Scrub night mask? No? Uh, regime, no, 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 oh, is the oils. <laughs> Oh, so after all the stuff that she said, you put on your moisturizer and then you just sit it in with the oils and then you go to sleep and you wake up with a nail. What oil do you use though? Yeah. Personally, I use jojoba mixed with uh, argan oil mm -hmm. and vitamin E. Gross. I made it myself, so yeah. That's so cute. Oh, so you make it yourself? I just blend yeah. the stuff, like just buy it. Uh, just okay. But then uh, we forgot to mention the face scrub and you know, you have to scrub your face. Uh, I hardly mask my face. face. Like, you, need mask to, face. you need what to. What do you use though? I have this, uh, it's a black mask. I got in the dwell. And, uh, but I feel like it's. Because I had it for a year now. I need to throw it away. My mask? Yeah. Is it like a, a powder? No, 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 no. It's, 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 it's black mask, but it, you can squeeze it from the container mm -hmm. and, then it, and then it becomes dry. Mm -hmm. And it's all great, and then I washed it. And it gives my skin really, really smooth. So I shouldn't put it away. But then also, um, I have this uh, blackhead scrub. Scrub. Uh, <laughs> scrub. 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 Um, by Himalaya. I uh, see. So, yeah. The things are so great. And the protein. But um, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try that. Yeah, so, and um, it's also important to like use cold, not, like tap water. Like don't use hot water because like your pores are gonna open. Yeah. So it's always great like you like washing your face with like cold water, you know, yeah. like so the pores don't really open and stuff. Sure. And always use primer. And if you don't use like a primer, like before your makeup, mm -hmm. aloe vera also helps. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But then I use the I use the SPF. Oh. Yeah, okay. because you get two types. You get one that uh, you, you squeeze out mm -hmm. of the bottle and one that sprays. Mm -hmm. So I spray here, spray here, spray, and then I just keep blending it. And then while it's still moist on the face, yeah. you just quickly uh, you dab your, your brush mm -hmm. in water or whatever, and then put on foundation, and then you just, mm -hmm. just goes in very hard. Now, the aloe vera that you used to as a primer, also, which one is it? That's for her, honey. I just <laughs> like buy the one from like. The pharmacy, oh. like any aloe vera, it's like a, like aloe vera is like really good for your skin burns, whatever it is, mm -hmm. like it helps, and your skin is always soft, mm -hmm. super soft. Okay. Oh, yeah. so that's your secret. Yes. 
I don't have the Because she's clothes. like so soft and I asked her once like girl what do you use? Yeah, so it's like <laughs> not only aloe vera but like dove is also cool because like my dermatologist said I should start using dove because like allergies and stuff. I love the, the the white one, right? Yeah. Oh, like I dove is recommended. Or sorbet. Sorbet is also great. Oh, so I was a deaf yeah. person and then I changed because I was like, no, oh, I want perfect skin. <laughs> yeah, no, it's cheap. And hey, always exfoliate. Yeah. Get yeah. those gloves, honey. I mean, exfoliate. I have gloves, like, yeah. gloves all the time. Yeah. And they really help your skin. It's smooth. Yeah. It's smooth. Yeah. So no one ever used um, what brown sugar to exfoliate? Yeah. No, I haven't. But well, I've, I've seen that. heard about it. I've heard about it. And brown sugar too, 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 too wax. Yeah. Alright, yeah. cool. So you exfoliate for what brown sugar? No. Mm. I just asked the question because I'm like curious because I actually wanted to know how they do it and also how they want to brown sugar because I don't have to stuff doing my own thing. Like it looks a topic for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so what's what's next? Shake it up. 